as promised in my vlog, I went to see uh, Tarzan, see two movies. I saw Tarzan first, Tarzan in 3D, uh, IMAX 3D. I saw that today. Uh, of course, this movie star Alexander Skarsgård, uh, Margot Robbie, Samuel Jackson, and Christopher Waltz. And basically, this story takes place um, after Tarzan has been brought back to civilization. And he's acclimated to life in London. He's Lord, Gr you know, Greystroke. And basically, he gets called back. Uh, he gets asked to investigate activities at a mining camp back in his native, you know, back in Africa. Uh, basically, the story is that the Africa has been split up uh, by, you know, by various powers, world powers, and the Pacific, the Congo area has been given to the Belgians, and and basically the guy is overextended. The guy who's in charge is overextended, and he basically sends his uh, Christopher Waltz's character uh, back to because there's a rumor that there's these famous diamonds, and that will help you know you know restock him and get him to uh, not be overextended and and firm his grip his grip on that place in Africa, in the Congo, where they live, because he's basically overextended. And so he sends his, his boy, Christopher Waltz, to investigate and to see if he can find these diamonds. And of course, Tarzan gets asked by uh, the British government and also Samuel Jackson, who plays a, a representative from the American government, uh, he basically tells him, listen, this guy, this uh, Belgian guy is overextended and we think something suspicious is going on. We'd like you to go back there and investigate. And of course, reluctantly, he decides to go back. And of course, uh, at first, he doesn't want his uh, Jane, uh, Margot Robbie, to uh, go, uh, return to her, but she's, of course, headstrong, of course, and she, she accompanies him back on there. And hence, there we have our movie. Uh, I really enjoyed this movie. This movie was directed by David Yates. I know he, I think he directed one of the Harry Potter movies. I forget which one. I think a couple of them he might have directed. Uh, but anyway, uh, I really enjoyed this movie. Uh, this, version of Tarzan. I thought Alexander Sikarska, uh was a, a really good Tarzan. He played the character sort of laid back and he didn't speak that much, which I think was which was good. I think fits with the character. And I like they told us, they didn't tell his origin story. They told his origin story in like flashbacks and they told his of his meeting with Jane and stuff. And then you got to see him go back to uh, Africa and interact with the people he left behind. And I thought that was the way they set the, that whole mission up. And of course, Christopher Waltz, I don't want to spoil it, but what happens, but, but if you've seen the trailer, you basically know what happens but between Christopher Waltz's character and Margot Robbie. He basically, so this is not a spoiler really, you know, he kidnaps uh, Jane because it's, well, it's, kind of, it's kind of central to the plot, so I don't want to spoil it, but there's a reason why he kidnaps Jane. Uh, okay, and it kind of deals into the plot, which I don't want to spoil. But I thought, this was, first I saw it in IMAX 3D, it was absolutely beautiful. Uh, the African, the cinematography of all the, all the obviously some of the albums were CG, you know, uh, CG, you know, CGI, but I thought it looked beautiful and natural to me. And I thought Christopher Waltz made a good villain, as usual. Christopher Waltz is a great actor. And I thought Margot Robbie, you know, doing the American accent, I thought she was really good as well. And Samuel Jackson <laughs> provided a lot of the comedy in the movie, exactly as this agent, you know, for the American government that accompanied Tarzan to, uh, to uh, back to Africa. I thought he was really good. Uh, and uh, I thought this movie was good. It had action, it had drama, it had romance. I, th I really, really enjoyed this uh, version of Tarzan's story and you know, the flashbacks to how he was raised and stuff and his relationships with the apes and stuff. I thought it was really well done and excellent. Okay, I really enjoyed this movie and I'd love to see a sequel to this. Again, good action, good drama, good romance. Okay, a good supporting cast. I can't say enough. I really enjoy this movie, uh, Tarzan. I'm going to give Tarzan an 8.5. Okay, I really, really enjoyed it. And I would love to see another adaptation or a sequel to this movie. It really, uh, it really impressed me and it really entertained me and it, it made me laugh when I had to laugh. And, it, you know, you felt sympathy for the characters you had to feel sympathy for. And Tarzan, I thought, Alexander Skarsgård looked the part, and he was really good. I loved the way they showed him swinging through the, on the vines and all that stuff. That was really, really cool. And just, I really enjoyed this movie a lot. I can't recommend it highly enough. 8.5 for me, Tarzan. Definitely go see it. Anyway, that's my review. Let me know what you think of Tarzan. If you've seen it, what do you think of it? Feel free to leave comments down below. If you like this review, please hit the subscribe button down below. 
I also have another channel called Paul's Views and Opinions. The link is in the description box below. Also links to my Facebook and Twitter, so please check those out as well. And this is Trey Pastor saying so long and take care.